Good morning, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Luis and Crypto Lou here, nickname. We are going to change a couple of things for this week. I just uh, briefly gonna upload this video to let you know. As uh, like I always say that I try to research and be more educated than financial, which I'm not financial advisor in any means. Um, or not just looking at speculation or financial situation, but more like education than anything else. So just briefly, we going to take a look on some of the, you know, uh, I post a video today already this morning, uh, on my playlist, which is, uh, best of crypto, which is, uh, the, my personal research that I have and the videos that I was downloaded from YouTube is the most important ones. None of those is like recently is more like the kind of old news that people like needs to re be remember for learn how to uh, deal with this uh, cryptocurrency situation. Right now we're looking at uh, my uh, uh, tweet account and I see this uh, Dogecoin friend analysis expect Bitcoin bullish mode after tax day, which is today here in the United States, it's, uh, April 17. Um, I also saw something about uh, XRP or Ripple talking about uh, some situation on uh, England and UK. And now it looks like Barclays is talking to clients about opening a crypto trading desk, which is uh, going to be a great news. I hope so. So take a look uh, over the Poloniex Stellar right now trade at 30 cents. The last 24 hours we have increased at 9.82%. We have all green numbers so far. <coughs> Today it's uh, uh, Tuesday, April 17. Right now it's 10.57 a.m. Eastern Time. Uh, Kraken has some situation and the news is more like the pretty much going to shut down. They're not confirmed yet, but it looks like they're going to shut down operations in Japan due to some regulations over there. Here in Kraken, we're looking at ATC, Titan Classic, which we have uh, below the average was around $20, and right now we trade at average sixteen thirty, dollars so a little bit below the average. We'll take a look at Coinbase, which is Coinbase. It's... Um, Right now, make some moves for this second quarter of the year. They started buying some companies out there. Uh, they, from the profit from last year, look like they improved uh, investments for this year and maybe for the future, which is always in cryptocurrency. We, we it's new. It's with Bitcoin being ten years old and so many coins, not even like a year. Uh, the ones, uh, you know, orders, and we, we're going to see some change in the future. Have Bitcoin Cash at 780, Ethereum 514. Litecoin, so many good news that we have is still trade and sell at the Coinbase on $137. We still look at GDAX, we have this 137 right now. Let's jump for GitHub on for Ripple XRP for the day. Look like a side trade. It was increased to 2.46%. The 24 high, 67 cents. So many great news about Ripple recently and XRP. But if you remember back uh, last year, like around August in the summertime, they had something going on in Canada, Toronto, more specifically. I think it called Sways. Well, it was a conference. They're supposed to be host, you know, so many talkers and guys who are supposed to be talking about the economy, you know, this and that, blah, blah, blah. So for that period of the year, I remember right, the price was from average 20 cents and then jump like to 30 cents. And even everybody was supposed to be the moment, which is going to go like crazy for $5. I didn't hit it didn't hit more than now time high, which is a previous one around 40 cents about maybe a year before that. 
So we have uh, uh, Ripple, so many good news that we don't know why the price didn't jump again to three dollars at least. But um, I would say it may be because the situation about the UK now Barclays saying they're gonna you know move into a, uh, a cryptocurrency. So we we uh, slowly like last year we might gonna see the improvement in a couple months or maybe another year from now. I uh, would say probably. We might have something like we have last year with the Bitcoin, every other coin jumping around December, all the way up to the first week of January, and then they're gonna sell it out, they're gonna sell off, and and then we back in a re- correction or beginning of the year or Chinese, you know, New Year's, it, whatever you wanna like keeping giving excuses for the hyper up and down for volatility from the market which is kind of crazy let's keep going by nancy it's the central land uh back in a 10 cents average when i first uh, uh heard about uh silver take like a battery silver talking about this coin by etdn i called this central land and i was able to find out how can i i could have you know come up you know, buying lands, whatever. It was an app on my cell phone, which is called Trust. It's kind of wallet from Ethereum. So they have a browser, and then you can log in. You can I kind of show before in the videos uh, before. Uh, trade them in uh, USDT. We take a look on NEO, which is another one that kind of go up. And $68 right now traded up. Uh, Pretty much the high was 70, which is great. So we we probably gonna see it back in a in the hundreds. Uh, maybe I would say towards the summer uh, for Neo, which is uh, could be great. Um, the other one that was Iota, which is let me show you guys on my app. It was called the Coin Desk, I think Coin Coin Status. Sorry about that. Coin status, we have a uh, the IOTA Internet of Things, which is um, we have some news on IOTA, which is about Microsoft. They like started going to invest a little harder on on a on IOTA uh, situation, I think. And, um, and let me show you guys here. Okay, IOTA. Oh, it's not, I don't have much going on. But anyway, um, for the week, it was uh, 63%. Let's see if we have any news. All right, let's show you guys this. IOTA is the 3.7 billion crypto developers love to hate. Verge stole the limelight. In a lackluster week in crypto markets, that's the Coyota, which is the one I'm talking about. Um, let's see if you can go around. Anyway, you want to turn. Cryptocurrency is uh, crawling with ambitious vision for the future. Indeed, in one of the most type of ways in which is the technology could come to proliferate is through its union with the concept called the Internet of Things. They don't talk about here uh, about a uh, Microsoft, but uh, I just heard and I was reading someplace else that Microsoft started invested real harder on the an IOTA. I think IOTA, well, Internet of Things. I, I, I would say this should be supposed to be IOTA. So um, that all my favorite coins that I'm following here in this one, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Ripple, Bitcoin Cash. I really don't see Bitcoin Cash as a favorite, but I'd follow anyway, just to take a look at the price. Litecoin, EOS, ADA. Uh, we have Stellar, IOTA, um, Mayota, Neo, XR, it's uh, Monero, Shane, Dash, 
uh, TRX, which is Tron, I believe. ETC, Ethereum Classic, <clears throat> Omega Go, Quantum, uh, BNB, is Binance Coin, uh, Verge, XVG, Ontology. Ontology is down 39%, 0.39%. Zcash, Order, Elf, Pivx, Mana, VTC, Agrello, and Bolt. I was taking a look at this Bolt situation and also called BoltCoin.net. I try to go to like a YouTube channel they're supposed to be having, but it's not working on a web page, at least on the cell phone. Um, the idea about this coin, it's kind of like, I believe should be good because if you look at Dries, which is a stock on, let's um, minimize here, let's go back and let's go. Let me show you guys something about this, uh, what it kind of like right here, 379. Okay, it's um, it's in the same location, but this is uh, my cell phone that you guys watching. This is from Hobbing Hood. A call interest in dry ship sink, and here's how it's performing recently. So the, that is the first news on dries from many many months. This is like a regular Nasdaq stock market. But I would see the relation or the correlation, which is uh, what they look at. You guys can take a look at the, you know, you can Google search for this company called Dry Ships. So it was this first, this coin, I mean, this share for this company was crazy because was, uh, now they keep saying the all time high for 52 weeks is $480. But if you go Google and you, and you look for this company and let's go Google, uh, and let's put dry stock. And if you look for the max, the price for this, it was over a billion. Billion dollars, sorry guys. <laughs> Billion dollars. When I looked first for this was after the drop and the bankrupt. They had so many uh sues in the back and look in 2016 was 31,000 and went down 17. Let's see. Let's go. Okay. It went down to dollar fourteen or maybe less. I think it was ninety nine cents. But say dollar fourteen, July twenty eighth, two thousand seventeen. So it's looking like it went. Why people saying why not this? Um, this is a company based on uh, Greek. It's a greasy company from a Greek company. So. Uh, that kind of like from this top billions of dollars share going down to a dollar, it was because economy, you know, 2017, all that. Everybody knows. So right now it tried to recuperate. I saw when it was a dollar a uh, share, they offered me to buy a thousand share for two dollars seventy, and right now it's hitting. Uh, it's going down, but it's hit a. 380 because it was up to if I'm not mistaken it, it went up already for five dollars a share if I know I'm mis 480 I think it was the high yeah 480 was the high so uh like uh I was showing you guys before this market it could be something and we have a coin to have a blockchain or technology uh try to help this um situation in the, in the ocean so I, I believe this um coin that i was talking to which is uh this one right now boat decentralized digital currents is a blockchain supporting maritime uh, projects and so if this working this is a good coin right now that i'm looking at it i believe 
it's very cheap it's less than one cent and never went high and the the high that went it was 1.3 cents actually so now it's below below a cent we see yeah, keep taking a look never know what's gonna happen so that all my favorite coins out there the cap, uh, market cap right now is 331 billion dollars and like I said I tried to make it briefly as videos but it's kind of crazy unbelievable I have to talk so much about this crazy but anyway guys thank you for watching always uh, keep a take a look on my uh, playlist for education videos from the past if you already saw the videos don't worry about it but if you haven't seen those videos it's a good ones uh, they talk about blockchain they talk about they're gonna put some more during the week because this week is gonna be this special on the playlist from from there and just today I'm doing this um, for talking uh, because I see the prices, some research, and also because uh, the news, the, mo the most exciting, I don't know if you're going to be excited or not, is the Kraken, which is they have uh, closed, or oh, they will be closed in Japan soon. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Always please subscribe and thumbs up, thumbs down, and talk to you guys soon. Have a good day. Bye.